Well, just as I predicted a couple of weeks ago, everybody, remember my video, I'll link to it here. The new Harbor Freight Skittles colors of the magnetic accessories for the U.S. General Series 2 toolboxes are here. Every possible color, look at them. The finish is just magnificent, and I bought a set of the blue ones. We're going to look at them right here in just a few minutes. So stick around and don't forget that the links are in the comments below. Hi ho neighbors. Welcome back. As promised, this is a video about the new Skittles Colors magnetic accessories from US General. I was able to pick these up, except for the glove one of course, with the 30% off coupon. But there's another video for that, so check that one out. What I wanted to do in this video is first we're going to have a look at them and unbox them. Then we're going to compare them to the ones that I already painted myself. So let's get started. Okay, well, let's start off with the ones we haven't seen yet. It's going to be the uh, glove holder. You can hear a cold magnet clicking on there. Four magnets with the rubber coating. Even got screws so you can hang it on the wall if you want to. Hang it on the wall if you want to. <laughs> right side up so the box doesn't fall out. And what do you think? Yeah, I gotta tell you guys, I, I think mine was a little bit closer match. My cobalt blue from Rust-Oleum, put a link to that just in case you don't like it either. What's the other one I don't have? I didn't do. It's gonna be the uh, spray can. Screwdriver holder. There's not enough holes in a five drawer tool cart to hang your screwdriver, so thank God they put one in this spray can holder for you. Now it looks like the uh, accessories are going to be pretty consistent in their color, but as far as, as the match of the, uh, it's, I guess it's pretty close. Never saw this before, but uh, yeah, there's there different hole sizes for your screwdrivers and spray cans. Six good magnets, and of course the don't scrape me up, protective for your uh, powder coat. That's the word I'm looking for. Now the two we do have. I have this and I spray painted mine. Link to the video up above and of course there's always links and information in the, the comments below so be sure and check that before you leave a comment and say well you didn't say because you know maybe I did say down there. Another box for the collection. There it is, that's Skittles color. Beautiful. Fantastic, fantastic. Boy, it looks almost as good as my spray painted one. Not. I haven't checked out the specs yet because I just saw this and ran down to Harbor Freight to get them. But I will check the specs and put it in here. But I'm guessing these are probably going to be powder coated or hoping they're going to be powder coated anyway. So, whoa, right here is this broken? This one might be broken. Look at this. Let's see. Is that one going to go back? Yeah, look at this. Broke right off there or something. How's that go on there? There we go, yeah. So that one's gonna go back. First time I've gotten some from Harbor Freight and it's actually been broken. If I was one of you great fab guys out there, I suppose I'd just go ahead and spot weld that back on there. Luckily, I've got one that will suffice until I take that one back. That's gonna require a 30 mile trip for me. But the other one's there, so 
we'll have this one to compare to mine. So we will be right back in just a second and we'll show you a comparison of the ones that I spray painted with the cobalt spray paint. Stick around. Now we're going to do a comparison to my cobalt blue paint, Rust-Oleum paint version versus the actual versions that came out. Now here they are side by side. Let me tip them up so that you could Let's do this. You could certainly tell mine because it's got the the bed liner coating on it. So you could see it turned out a little bit more brilliant blue than my match. But actually, I, we're going to compare that later. I think my match of the cobalt blue is a little bit closer to the actual color of the cart. Here are the uh, paper towel holders. You can see that for sure when you put them side by side. The cobalt blue of mine is definitely lighter than what the brilliant blue of that U.S. General uses on their powder coat. But look at the finish. It's just, it's really gorgeous. Good fit and finish. Nice job. Nice job, guys. Did a good job. We're going to be back in just a second. And we'll put them on the cart in a uh, big area so that you can see just how close the colors are. We'll see who got closer, U.S. General or me. We'll be right back. And here we are with a side-by-side -side comparison. And this is on the field of, of blue powder coat that's on my five-drawer U.S. General tool cart. We're going to pan around a little. Here you go. Uh, and this blue field really makes a difference. I mean, at, at glance, it looks like mine matches pretty good. But until you come around and see the Harbor Freight accessories, I didn't, I didn't do as well as I thought. In this picture here, you can see it really stands out that, that mine's off. It's really not quite that bad. But now that you can see the new Harbor Freight accessories, or U.S. General accessories. There wasn't much doubt in my mind that they would obviously look better. First of all, because, you know, they could have the uh, ability to match the paint better. And, and of course, it's powder coated, so it's going to be better. See, I use the truck bed liners. I'll put a link to that video. They did pretty good, and but to me, it is a little darker. It may be hard to see in these pictures. So there might be a slight color variation, and, you know, it's not a big deal to me. So hopefully it's not a big deal to you guys either. They're just very beautifully done, and with the exception of my broken towel holder that I'm going to take back, the fit and finish is very nice. Well, that is going to just about do it. For this video, I want to thank all of my awesome subscribers and all you you supporters out there who are making the comments and coming up with the good ideas. I really appreciate every one of you. Don't forget to check the comments below for information on the swell new products from U.S. General at Harbor Freight. Like, share, and subscribe as usual. You have a great weekend, everybody.